Hajawapa eh, amri lakini I know he meant to, to tell you to work with your chair at every level. He mentioned chiefs. It's very, very important that you work together from today. And the confession that kila mtu anachunga tafu yake. Kula. That is also the end. It has reached the end today. Kebs. Kebs move closer. Yeah, Kebs is here. KCA, get ready uh, to take two minutes, please, Kebs. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Your Excellency. Uh, all protocols have served. I am Dr. Geoffrey Moriera, representing Managing Director Kenya Bureau of Standards. And I, I want to speak about the five aspects briefly that can enhance the synergy that uh, I've seen here. The first thing is about the standards. In Kenya, we have 25 standards covering various brews, but they are not well applied. So if all the agencies represented here understand those standards, I am sure we will not have substandard and toxic products in the market. Point number two is about product certification. In this region, Uh, there is one area that we can look at because we have standards for the local brews. We can uh, certify those local brews because we have standards for Changa, we have standards for um, Nazi, and then we have in those hot spots areas where they can be produced. And this uh, ethanol can also be used for industry, not for human consumption. It can be used for industry, not for human consumption. It can be controlled, and then we can avoid abuse. The other thing that I want to talk about is market surveillance. I want to agree that we need to have more officers that are involved in market surveillance and intensify these activities, the intelligence activities. The other thing is that in our regional office, we have testing laboratory with capacity. So any product that is used, can be taken to our labs to be tested, and this can support the multi-agency activities. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. Okay, I'm going to introduce myself. I said I'm Dr. Geoffrey Moriera. I work as Director Quality Assurance and Inspection at Kenya Bureau of Standards, and I'm representing the Managing Director Kenya Bureau of Standards. Thank you. Uh, followed KCA. KCA is also being, uh, he's representing the CEO, uh, Mr. John Akoten. Please come and take your two minutes. Um, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, all protocols observed. Uh, good morning. I'm John Akoten, Director for Research Awareness and Quality Assurance at the Anti-Counterfeit Authority. I'm here standing in for the CEO, Dr. Ruby Mbugwa, uh, who was not able to join us this uh, morning. Now, as ACA, we are part and parcel of the multi-agency uh, team that was started some time back in 2018, where ACA uh, spearheaded the formation of a multi-agency framework uh, under Gazette Notice number 7250 of 2018. Uh, in this particular framework, uh, um, the enforcement uh, wing was being spearheaded from the Office of the President, while the public awareness was being spearheaded uh, from the State Department of Industry. Now, as ACA, we've been able to work under the multi-agency framework where we seized around 20 million Kenya shillings worth of illicit brews just last year. And last month, out of that, uh, a quarter of that uh, volume actually came from here in Mombasa. And last month, we were able to seize uh, illicit uh, brews worth 1.2 million Kenya shillings here in Mombasa. And this one has risen to 115 cases, where some of these cases we've been able to resolve them uh, through what's called the ADR process, 
where the culprits have been fined and their goods were destroyed.